Where's my jester's hat? Give it back. Return that, you know. The gits are about overcoming adversity. They're about addiction, they're about loss, they're about love. Life and pain and misery, energy. Passionate and raw and out there. They're a theme track for revolution. And then Mia was just such a huge force. She was a badass in every aspect. Fuck, you got her heart and soul. It's like a fucking bomb going off. It is unbelievable. People who are, as far as I was concerned, godlike. Break it up! People were indoctrinated. They came and they saw this band, and it opened some passageway up in them. There was this tremendous following of fans. I, mean, I don't want to say we were living large, but we were living pretty large, you know? As a band, they set the bar for other people to go chasing on after. Fuck, if you're not playing in your own favorite band, then you shouldn't be playing. It was really life-changing for a lot of people. We became, I think, a real band of the people. It was a force of nature. There has not been anything like them since then. It's what I was doing, what I loved doing, and then we had to stop doing it. When Mia was murdered, that just destroyed us all. Everybody was just blown away and just stunned. Like, the world caved in, the fucking walls came tumbling down. It still makes me sad that there's so much more we could have done. What the fuck happened? Me and the Gits, it's not a story about a Seattle band. It's not a story about a punk rock band. It's not a story about a band with a woman singer. This is the story of a great American rock and roll band.